Hello, grade 8, and welcome to this week's weekly breakdown. During this week, we are going to be starting with Unit 4, the solar system. Unit 4 has two topics. The first topic is the Earth, Sun, and Moon system. So during this lesson, we are going to be talking about planets, sun, and the moon system. Starting off with the first part of this lesson is talking about why do the stars appear to move, to move? An Indian astronomer said that the light that the moon and the planets shine is found because they reflect light from the sun. All of these hypotheses and conclusion came through him looking or observing through the sky with his naked eye. He did not have telescopes or he did not use them. And he also thought about the objects that can be found in the sky, such as satellite, comets, meteors, constellation. Starting off with meteors. Meteors are the shooting stars that we view with our naked eye, but they're actually a piece of rock or ice that is burned up and it enters the Earth's atmosphere. As for comets, they are usually more rare to see, and it is a cold mixture of dust and ice that develops a long trail of light. Both of meteors and comets can be viewed as objects in space. Moving on to constellation. Constellation is the pattern that stars make to show a figure or represent a figure or an animal that is used mostly in Greek and Roman cultures and uh, these constellations are now used such as horoscope figures or used in characters and mythological constellations of Greek myths. Also, during this lesson, we are going to talk about the movement of objects in the sky. How does the solar system planets move in the space? And as usual, we are going to be assessing our knowledge by online quizzes and watching a lot of simulations. Since we want to view the space, we are going to use simulations and a lot of interactive websites from NASA to try and have a view of the solar system and see how the planets move and talk more about the system. We're going to use online quizzes, interactivities to get the full picture of the Earth, Sun and Moon system. That is it for this week. I hope this week brings you knowledge. Thank you so much, 8th grade.